Hello everybody and welcome to tonight's video and thank you for joining me on my channel. Tonight I'm talking about another Silver Dollar City property pin. Uh, this pin is actually a pin from 2003. Excuse me while I make an adjustment here. This is a 2003 pin and it's actually from an attraction from Silver Dollar City in Branson, Missouri that no longer exists and that's Rube Dugan's Diving Bell. This was a simulator attraction that uh, gave you the feeling that you were going under the water and had a little adventure on the screen, uh, similar to some of the programs and attractions that Disney puts out. Uh, Rube Dugan's Diving Bell, though, however, was um, replaced in 1985 with another attraction that I'll talk about here in just a minute with some news from Silver Dollar City. This pin, like I said, is a 2003 pin, but it's kind of a unique pin in that it's what they call um, a piece of history pin. Uh, so the pin itself is a good sized pin. It's a single post pin. It has the uh, official pin trading Silver Dollar City on the back of it, 2003. But uh, it does have a little plexi bubble that has been embedded into the pin. Now inside that bubble is some sand and that sand is supposed to be from the Rube Dugan's diving bell ride. So you actually, by having one of these pins, you have a little piece of that ride, a little piece of Silver Dollar City history uh, besides the pin itself. Actually some, um, some solid matter that has come from that attraction. So kind of a neat pin there. Now, like I said, this attraction was replaced in 1985 by an attraction called uh, the Lost River of the Ozarks. And the Lost River of the Ozarks is a tube raft ride in the round tubes, very similar to Collie River Rapids at Disney World, to where up to, I think, it's either six or eight passengers could ride per tube, and you go on a rafting adventure, and it's a wet ride. So since 1985, or for the last 32 years, 33 years, uh, people have been going to Silver Dollar City and it was a way for them to escape the heat of the summer because you would get wet on the ride and has been very popular over the years. So the news from Silver Dollar City that has come out today is that ride has now been closed. The walls have gone up. Uh, they have started disassembling the attraction itself. They started doing that back in early December while their Christmas uh, experience was going on. And that ride is going to no longer be as of this season at Silver Dollar City. They are hinting and teasing at a new attraction that they are already beginning work on in the location where uh, the uh, Lost River of the Ozarks was but uh, are being very hush-lipped about it right now, not letting out anything as far as what that attraction is going to be, only that it's going to be something special and something new. Of course, last year they opened up the what's right now the world's tallest, fastest, steepest spinning roller coaster when they did open up Time Traveler for guests this year. So it's hard to tell right now what they're going to replace the Lost River of the Ozarks with. Again, the attraction had been there since 1985. So after 33 years, they're mothballing it, disassembling it, and getting ready to use that property for something totally different. I'll let you know as soon as I know what it is. But uh, just exciting news coming out of Silver Dollar City that they're starting to really upgrade and build in more attractions that may be not only more up to date, but hopefully family friendly and that it doesn't just turn into a roller coaster park like so many parks do. And uh, we would like to see some more family attractions, more on the line of Disney, uh, so that it can continue to draw the crowds that it draws. Last year they did have the uh, record-breaking crowds at Silver Dollar City, and I'm sure that they hope to continue that for years to come. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed Rube Dugan's Diving Bell pin and the news about the Lost River of the Ozark. Uh, let me know if you've ridden that ride. If it's something you think you're going to miss, leave it down in the comments. I will see you back tomorrow with another pin. I hope you guys have a great evening. And as always, make sure and like the page if uh, the content is something that you're enjoying. And certainly subscribe. Subscriptions are always free. Guys, have a great night.